mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. It doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. Kopitar's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Deflection. Quick pass to Dreisaitl. Into the offensive end now. Puts it on net. What a chance, but can't finish. Well, you got to make good on a chance like this. This is deflating, James. You don't even put it on the net and test the goaltender. That's a huge miss. And he shut the door on that last play. They are really busting here in the offensive end. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much-needed stoppage. Deneau's gained possession, and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. And he takes the pass. Crosses the puck loose. Here's a chance, and that one's denied. Fiello's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Picked up along the boards by Moore. Moves it to Nugent Hopkins. Gains the zone through the middle. Slides it across to Moore. Moves it quickly over to Deneau. Slittering feed, and that carries off a twig in front of the net. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Scooped up along the wall by Janmark. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Slides it over with pace to Fiala. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Ekholm stick handling in his own zone. Quick feed to McLeod. Edmonton's gained the line and into the zone and uses the length of the stick to knock that puck away. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Mubarari is cutting against the boards. And there's another stop. He reads this play perfectly. Plays it in on the breakaway. Oh, what a save on the play. Well, uh, James, I think he might have gotten in too tight here when he was selling the fake, but a nice save by the goaltender. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a Scoring chance there. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Good heads up play to sneak in there on the tie up and come up with the puck. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, he couldn't put it past. What a stop by Talbot. I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James, but man, he flashed the leather. He made the save, no rebound to boot. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, we've still got zeros on the board. And a quick little stick lift and comes up with the turnover. They put the puck into the offensive end. Kulak's got the puck in his own zone. Feeds it on over to Dayarnay. And they'll dump it in. Los Angeles gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Grabbed along the board by Kulak. Edmonton's looking to break out. Here they come on the rush. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. LA's ready to go on the attack. Puck picked up by Kopitar. A fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. The reason why he can get square to it and make the save. And this squad has really put the pressure on now. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. Nugent Hopkins wins possession in the defensive zone. CeCe's loving the puck. Here's a short pass to Yanmar. Nice poke check. Moves the puck across to Moore. Here's an off man rush. Takes the feed at the point. Blocked in traffic. The Oilers are in transition. To his teammate. on pass X 
execution. Well, this is a clear example when the pass is crisp and it's on the tape, it's on the money, it finds the back of the net. Edmonton's got to be feeling good about their game tonight. Here they already lead in this one, and they've been dictating the pace of play also. Well, they get the game's first goal midway through the period, James, but I liked their game right from puck drop. I mean, the way that they started, the urgency around the puck, they pounded it, they had a heavy forecheck, and now they get rewarded for their efforts. Picked up by Moore. Los Angeles has been so good shutting down the middle of the ice. They're anticipating the passes, and they're closing quickly. And because of that, they're turning pucks over and intercepting them as well. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. Jumped in, and they'll go get some fresh legs. Receives the pass. Edmonton's got the puck behind the net. Gets the puck in deep. The Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Solid check to slow down. They can do with it. Works it across to Kane. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. And that's intercepted by Kaliev. Puck grab by Roy. Moves it quickly over to Kaliev. Takes a shot. And the goaltender comes up on a piece of it to keep it out of the net. And now he moves it quickly to Yanmark. Break away. Indecisiveness there, Cheryl. Yeah, and a lack of confidence as well, James. When you're in all alone, you have to know exactly what you want to do, and you have to play with authority. Los Angeles has possession of the puck. Takes it off, but he's still got the puck. Long lead pass to Nugent Hopkins. Oh, smart heads are playing to put that one away. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Just fantastic work by the goaltender, making consecutive saves. How athletic. LA's have put up a lot of shots so far here in the first, but they still haven't found any finish or any solid results yet. 
Dubois won the draw, and they'll look to set up. A chance from the slot. Oh, what a save in front. What a fantastic save from a high-danger scoring area, James. And, I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Oh, so good. What a stop. Now, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Well, as play continues, can you feel the love tonight? Listen to this place here, Cheryl. I can feel it. You can feel it. And he can feel it after that last save. Because you know what fans appreciate? They appreciate effort, James. And that's how that save was made. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. Here's a pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Here in the late goings of the period, Edmonton's ahead, 1-0. McLeod's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Los Angeles has the puck. Dumps it in. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Quick feed to McLeod. After that hit. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Harry's getting two for interference here. He's off to the box. The Kings will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. And the puck departs the zone. One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender! And he had an that save! Here's a short pass to Deneau. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to hope that one away. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. is ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. Puck dumped in. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Centering feed! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there! Let's it go! And does it again! And it's kicked away. From off the wall and onto a stick. Centering pass! What a chance, but they can't connect! Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Nugent Hopkins is ready for the faceoff as they'll continue to kill off this penalty. LA's won the faceoff. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a piece of that one! There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. The Kings would love to even things up before the end of this period as they trail despite being the busier team in the shots department. The man advantage fails to capitalize as they remain a goal down. Specialty teams are critical, especially when you're down by a goal and have an opportunity to get the equalizer, and they just weren't able to generate anything on that one. And that's a tough one to take as they remain down by a goal at even strength. And with the buzzer, that puts a bow on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here.
back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, over to the third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Well, James, this has been a really fast game. It's got a ton of pace, but the goaltenders have been excellent in this one. Back and forth action, making a number of saves. You've got to expect that it's going to blow open soon if this continues. I'm surprised it's only 1-0. L.A.'s been impressive, putting a lot of pucks on net, but they still trail here in the second. And they win the offensive zone faceoff. Now let's see if they can capitalize. And he makes the save on that play. LA's gonna hold him it against the wall. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. Moves the puck along the half wall. Takes the feed. Muvarare's picking up steam. Slides it over to McDavid. The Oilers cross the blue line and are on the attack. Los Angeles looks to get things going now with the puck. The Kings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Takes the feed. Drives to the sweet spot. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Here's a chance. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Quick pass to Dowdy. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Long reach breaks up the momentum. There's a firm collision. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Slides it diagonally to Kane. And he slides it quickly to Nugent Hopkins. Answered the call there. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. From the open ice, they gain the line. Fires it on net, and he comes up with it. Skinner's going to elect to just hang on for a whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, and I like that he landed on this one. He's physically engaged and keeping himself in it. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Oilers lead it 1-0. Gets the foot. Oh, this looks dangerous. Across the line. Great save on the play. Oh, my goodness. He says let's get physical on that play. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Los Angeles has taken possession off the draw on their own end. And it's a quick pass to Echo. And this is over the net. Here's an opportunity. Oh, what a stop on the play. Los Angeles with possession in their own zone. They get it out of the defensive end. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Taken by Echo. Angles it over to Nugent Hopkins. Here's a shot. Turns it aside with the glove. Well, we know he's got a great glove hand, and man, does he ever show it off right there with that stop. Deneau's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. McLeod's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Crafts out possession of the puck. Edmonton's got it from behind the net. Moves it to Kane. Moves the puck down low. Spence is almost back on the ice. Both sides are evened up as the power play has expired. Well, everyone is up. The coach knows exactly what the PK unit had to do, and they got out there, they were responsible, and they took care of business. A critical face-off looming here. Let's see if they can maintain that offensive momentum. Well, you know that the defensive side is vulnerable right now with a tired tender. And on the offensive side, you got to recognize that vulnerability and you have to attack the net. Slides the puck over. With possession along the wall. 
Moves it quickly over to Nurse. He scores! Extended the lead to two here in the second. And I think they need to continue to play desperate. Don't sit back. There's a lot of runway left. Continue to take control of the game. LA is going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that faceoff. Grabs the puck at center. Los Angeles plays it along the wing. Quick feed to Spence. Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. The Kings need to find a way to convert on one of these scoring chances as they trail here in period number two. Dubois won the draw there on the attack. Denies the chance by blocking it. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Picked up along the wall by Echo. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Now a quick pass to Echo. Centering feed. Defensive heads up play to pick it off. Los Angeles plays it against the boards. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. The Oilers carry it along the wall. Way too much congestion blocks that. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a face off. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Edmonton's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. McLeod's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. And a solid save on the play there. Talbot's been excellent tonight, James. I mean, the score could be a lot worse. The save percentage is great. He's doing everything to keep his team in it. They need to shore up their defensive end and get going north. Puck sent over to try to shake the defender. He's in. deflators for the entire team. James thought he had a piece of it and it just dribbles into the back of it that he wants that one back. Edmonton's carried the puck like it's been on a string all night, Cheryl. Puck's been on their stick and their opponent's been on their heels. They've just been worn down with the offensive zone possession time. And how about the goaltender? Seen so much rubber tonight and a lot in the netting. Oh, he'll feel that one. And it doesn't reach the net because it goes off the stick. Good use of the body to knock the puck loose. The Kings gain possession. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Here's a chance. Scores! And they do it again and again and again. Now the coaches will be preaching this and have no mercy. Continue the pound and continue the beating because they are on a roll. Edmonton's got a lot of skill on this roster, and we are seeing it in full effect. And we're only, what, halfway through this game here, period number two? Yeah, it's pretty impressive, isn't it? I mean, the confidence at which the entire lineup is playing with is outstanding. The puck's on their stick, they're working their magic, they're manipulating their opponent, and they're filling the net. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Shot! Oh, he got all of that! What a save by Riddick! Well, he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes a save. More than half the frame has been played here. Edmonton's latest goal has now given them a four-goal lead. Oh! just not getting the job done as that one goes by. You know who else is not getting the job done? The team in front of them. 
Edmonton's on a joyride type of night. Everything going their way. All the offense, all the goaltending, all the defense, and we're still only in the second. Dare I say they may get the day off tomorrow, James? Coach has to be so impressed with their performance so far. It's like they're playing a game of keep away out there. The Oilers will play it in their own end. And he slides it quickly to Hyman. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. The Oilers gain control of the puck. And he loses control here. Gets the puck in deep. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. Dreisaitl's got a hold of the puck behind the net. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. McDavid's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, he stopped it. What a save on the play. And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Denies him in close. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time? You want to take space? Goaltender does it, makes the save. Edmonton's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. Quick pass to Turkov. Los Angeles on the attack. Quick shot. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Kopitar is the leader of this team, and who do you look to when you're down? You find a way to look to your leaders. They create momentum. Everyone jumps on board. This game is not out of reach yet. Here he is in close. We're going to face off after the puck stays covered up. Past the midway mark of the frame. One-sided, lopsided, blowout, you name it. 5-0 is where we're sitting. Kopitar's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. The Oilers looking against the half wall. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the face off. The Kings come up with the defensive zone draw. Takes it at center. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Dumps it in. LA's got the puck along the boards. Dowdy's taking it from his own end. Gets the puck over to Moore. The Kings play it along the wing. What a stop by Skinner. Slides it quickly to McLeod. LA's got the puck here in the open ice. Stopped with ease. Los Angeles has it in the defensive end. And now it's grabbed by Fogel. Quick pass over to Perry. He carries the puck up along the wing. Sends one up to Fiala. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Nugent Hopkins. And that's off a stick. Deneau's got the puck along the wing. Center and key. And that's stopped. Here in the late goings of the period, Edmonton's got a 5-0 lead. That's right, 5-zip is where we sit. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Puck scooped up by Nugent Hopkins. Here's a shot! Turned aside with the glove by Riddick. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. And they take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. Here's a short pass to Kellyev. LA's on the attack. And now he moves it quickly to England. And that's knocked away by CeCe. And he keeps possession. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Under all sorts of pressure trying to protect the puck. Moves it to Kane. The Oilers with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. And with
with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Denies him with the pad. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Edmonton's been bringing the heat offensively all night long, and they continue to lead here late in this middle frame. Dubois has won it off the faceoff. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Tries to feed it over to Dreisaitl. Moves the puck. Poked away at center by Anderson Dolan. Oh, we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The officials are all over that. That opportunity is rejected. And they score! They score on the delayed penalty, James, so that's going to negate their power play, but looks like they didn't need it. James, these are the kind of pesky goals that create a ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have a hard stick, be heavy on it, with it on the ice, battle and compete for it. He does it and he buries it. LA's been on their heels all night long, but they finally pushed back here in period number two. Certainly something positive to get on the board, but they're gonna have to build on top of it if they wanna really create some momentum and believe that they're back in this game. Scooped up along the wall by Roy. The Oilers move it ahead. They've got numbers here. Here's a shot. Nice save from point blank range. Puts it on net. Another stop by the goaltender. You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back to back. Slides the puck over to Bouchard. 40 minutes to play in the books. Both teams will get one last chance to catch their breaths, and then it's on to period number three next. Hey kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team, you'll have the opportunity to have a couple of our players sign autographs after the game. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now on this one. How do you view things? Edmonton's been driving play all game. They sit with a comfortable lead with 20 minutes to go here, and they need to make sure they manage the puck and make smart decisions, and then they can call this one a win. Great puck by Nurse. Simple stop by Skinner. Tries to get it to McDavid. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Oh, what a stick save! Sends it over to Dowdy. Slides the puck ahead to Turcotte. Edmonton's got possession at center. McDavid's got the puck. And that shot dies in traffic. Grabbed along the board by McDavid. Here's a shot. And they got caught up in traffic and hits a stick. Handles the puck. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Los Angeles takes possession of the puck. Tosses it to Turcotte. Puck moved over to Dowdy. Quick feed to Byfield. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Janmark's got it along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Nugent Hopkins. With the stop. And that's a great heads up play by Riddick. Edmonton's offense has been a thing to watch tonight as they lead it big time here early in the third. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Made that stop. Here he is with the backhander. He scores! It looked like he had made the save, but that's in the back of the net for a goal. I think he makes a really good read here, James. He anticipates the play well and gets himself square to the shooter, but unfortunately, this one hits him and he seems to be a little leaky because it finds its way to the back of the net. Edmonton's offense continues to shine here in this third period. Well, this has got to be a dream for a coach. You know that they're telling their team in the intermission to make sure they stay to business, stay to task, stay focused. And that's exactly what they've done, and they just hammered their opponent. Fires it! Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. That knocks him off the puck. LA's got it in their own zone. Makes 
his presence known on the ice. Gains the zone from the right side. for his efforts. And they used their speed on this counter attack and gave themselves an odd man advantage here, James. And what they did was they capitalized. They had multiple looks. They could pass it. They could shoot it. Goaltender couldn't figure it out. It winds up in the back of the net. The Oilers continue to attack the net here at period number three, adding yet another goal to their score. Well, it's been all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight, James. I've also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice, not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, they're creating all over the ice, and it's been real fun to watch. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Good hit on the play. Takes a shot, and he makes the save. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. Here they come on the attack. Shot, stick, save, and a beaut by Skinner. A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Edmonton's been way more active here tonight on the ice, and they have certainly capitalized on their opportunities and continue to lead in the third. Lazat's won the faceoff. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Moves it quickly over to Kelly. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Now you're down a bunch of goals here, James. And really, you take the penalty because you're chasing the game. And you want to get back into a hit. But this one, this one's a tough one to take. play. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Off the draw, he ties up his opponent. Lazat's got it in the defensive end. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Great use of the stick at center by Kane. Quick pass to Lazar. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware. Knows where the shooter is in that low slot and makes the save. Kopitar's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Kings win the faceoff. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Kane. Shot. Oh, what a hit. You're in the slot. You've got to hit the net. Standing up, ready to go. Well, with a hefty lead, the team looks comfortable, and certainly that power play did. Yes, they didn't execute, but didn't seem to have the urgency that they had earlier in the game. Takes a shot. That's wide of the net. Now a quick pass to Eckholm. Comes up with the stop. Oh, turns it aside once again. Here's a short pass to Nurse. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Turcotte's carrying it ahead. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Dumps the puck in. Taken along the wall by Mubarare. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. And the extended stick ends that one. Now he slides it up to Kellyev. Directed over to McLeod. The Oilers have it from their own end. Sends it quickly to Eckholm. Slides it across to Perry. Puck picked up by Deneau. Passes 
passes it over to Fiala. Here's a chance. Turn it aside with a glove by Skinner. Well, that's an unbelievable save. A great A scoring chance taken away as he flashes the leather and makes a stop. Edmonton's put in a total team effort here this evening, and they lead it comfortably in the third. Los Angeles wins the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Moves it to Hyman. Slick feed. Feeds the puck over. Gets a piece of it on the glove. The Oilers get a hold of the puck along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Echo. Takes the puck. And he passes it up ahead to McDavid. And look at this. They really ratchet it up the intensity here. The D picks it up, but they are still under pressure. Mubarari has got it in the offensive zone. Comes up with a stop. Up along the wing. Picked up along the wall by McDavid. Reaches out and uses the stick. Tries to get it over to Anderson Dolan. Oh, so good. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at his finest. Edmonton's motor has been non-stop tonight. Lots of shots on net, and they lead in the third. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Blocked in traffic. Puck grabbed by Brown. Look out! Makes the save, but barely with that one. Dumps it into the ozone. And he can't hang on after that hit. Rocks him into the boards. Along the half wall with the puck. The Oilers have it now. Quick pass across to Brown. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Tries to get the puck to Turpak. On the attack along the boards. Big time save. Oh, he is looking good in there tonight. Handles the pass. Kopitar's got the puck in his own zone. Looks to make a play over to Byfield. Quick feed to England. From the slot. Scores! His first of the playoffs, and the rookie gets it done. Well, every athlete wants to establish themselves as a playoff performer. Well, the rookie, an impressive start to leaving a lasting impression. The Kings are starting to show a little respectability here amongst themselves as they get one back. Yeah, it's about mojo. It's how you end the game with good habits because you want to make sure that you don't carry the beginning of the game into your next one. Works it across to Turkoff. Cuts it away in his own end. And he hangs on to the puck. Scores! We'll get those rally caps on. Well, everyone's going to need to have one on. It's going to be a team collective contribution if they want to get back in this one. But it all starts with one goal. If they can layer it, find a way to get another one quickly, you never know. Certainly down, but not out completely yet. The Kings don't really have time on their side here, but at least they've got something to push with. Yeah, a really tough hole to climb out of, but certainly that one goal will give them a little bit of a lift. It's respectable. Nugent Hopkins has two goals in the game already, James. You know that he's playing with a ton of confidence, and he can feel and taste that third. Steps into the offensive end. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. What a block as he lays out in front of it. Deneau's made an incredible play there, James. He stumbles in front of the net, but finds the puck and could have lost it, but manages to stay with it enough to get a shot off. Los Angeles has it against the half wall. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. Los Angeles looks to move the puck from their own end. Passes on over to Deneau. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a chance! Oh, what a slick stop by Riddick! That's blocked! The Kings have it now. Great pass from off the right side. The Oilers are in transition. Gains the zone on the left wing. Sends a pass in front! And he 
shuts down a great scoring chance there. Who had the edge in Carlin Bain's mind? She's standing by with the answer. Kopitar's been able to contribute by generating scoring chances, and you know his teammates appreciate it. I think he's been the player that stood out for me, guys. They find themselves in favorable spot. Edmonton's added yet another one here to the total tonight. What a performance. Yeah, they've had the puck on their stick for a majority of this game. You know the coaching staff is going to be impressed. Hey, maybe they'll get the day off tomorrow. Takes it to the front. Stop by the goaltender. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Edmonton's manufactured plenty of offense tonight, and they lead here late in this third period. LA's gonna start with the puck in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Kopitar. Los Angeles plays the puck along the boards. Just an easy pass save made by Skinner. The Kings will play it in their own end. Quick pass to Turkov. Looks to get the puck over to McLeod. Takes a shot off the mask of the goaltender. Boy, right between the eyes. Well, James, that brings new meaning to putting everything in front of the puck to make a save as it goes pop with his mask. Not to he scores! The Slovenian stun. Oshay Kopitar makes it. Well, the goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. The thought that he was set to position, just the blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. LA's fan base watching, streaming, taking this one in wherever, probably wondering, where was this earlier? Yeah, it's frustrating for an athlete when you know what you can play like, you know what your team can play like, you just don't perform. But late in the game here, they need goals. They need a pile of them if they even want to have an opportunity to get their tender out of the net. Well, it's been a complete blowout, James. Now you take a penalty and it stops the clock. It's a frustrating night. You just want to move on.